Welcome all my viewers of Sigley Barman School. That's a week time for science and today we will have the final revision for this semester. So please pay attention to this uh, uh, episode, especially all our questions which we have grouped to all of you this uh, day. So please, again, pay attention for all our questions today because all of them are very important and uh, some of this question may be in your exam tomorrow. So let's start with the first type of question, which is complete the following statement in this question. I advise you please read the question carefully uh, till the end word. Because you may need a certain arrangement. So let's start with the first question. The first question says that the light bulb consists of what, what and what. Do you remember that? Light bulb, our Mizbah al kahrabi consists of three main parts, which are what, what, and what. Surely, light bulb consists of base, let us see the question, base, and glass bulb, and also at the last filament. Again, light bulb consists of base, glass bulb, and the filament, which is made of tungsten. And we know the filament is made of tungsten because it's has or because it has high melting point again we have a very important give reason in this question and this give reason question is a frequent question also i'm going to carry it then so i'll be only give reason lil filament is made of tungsten again li i will give reason the filament is made of tungsten because the tungsten has ha has high melting point tungsten metal thing another question that says Materials are classified into point and point according to their conductivity of electricity. Surely I can hear excellent people answer this question that says electric conductors and also electric insulators. Electric conductors and electric insulators. Again, Materials are classified into electric conductors and also electric insulator according to their conductivity of electricity. Another question that says, suction pump is what lever? Suction pump is what lever or what, what type or what class of lever? While point is a second class lever. Determine the type of the suction pump and also the second class lever give me example of them. Suction pump, we know suction pump is the first class lever. We have drawn suction pump many, many times. We have a lot of applications that have a new lever. We have a simple drawing and have a three points which are O, R, F. If O in the middle, I will O here in the middle, the fulcrum, it will be the first class lever. If R in the middle, it will be second class lever, resistance. If F, effort force in the middle, it will be third class lever. While what is a second class lever? We have many examples of second class lever, such as wheel paro, nut cracker, bottle opener, and many examples of second class lever. Again, in this question, I must uh, notice that. What's the difference between first and second class lever? First class lever is the most common lever. Like in second class lever is the lever that always conserves effort. Second class lever is the best type. Second class lever again is the best type. Why? Because it has uh, effort force are more than or longer than or bigger than or greater than any mana. Mamna kun akbar min resistance arm. You have a short term him again then. Lidem and a second class lever saves effort because it has effort force arm longer than the resistance arm. So now I must write this give reason. Give reason him again then that says give reason question. Nikta mabad give reason him again then that says give reason. Second class lever, second class lever. Second class lever, the offer and not a second class levers, always, always conserves effort. They men but offer maghut. Our side means I can the best type was was meant up by, by the best type. Hey, Ahsan no lever, Ahsan mil first class, who can man a third class. Lee, they men in second class lever, he a best type because it has. It has effort force, effort force arm longer than 
longer than or greater than longer than resistance arm يبقى دايما عندها كده effort force arm F arm longer than resistance arm عشان كده هي النوع او بنسميها the best type احسن نوع lever is the second class lever because it has effort force arm longer than the resistance arm so now let us have another question that is complete question and I advise you again نصيحة مهمة جدا في السؤال ده please read the question carefully اقرا السؤال كويس قوي till the end word so now the question says light pulp changes what energy into what energy light pulp المصباح الكهربي او اللمبة الكهربائية changes بتحول what energy into what energy changes electric energy into light energy electric energy into light energy again light pulp changes what changes electric energy into light energy and also heat energy ممكن لو في 3 complete هنا او 3 points يبقى light pulp بتحول electric into light and heat and also we have studied two type of lamps this semester which are light pulp and the fluorescent lamp light pulp and the fluorescent lamp again we have studied three two type of lamps which are light pulp and fluorescent lamp another question that says filament of the electric lamp filament of the electric lamp is made of tungsten again and again so the مهم جدا لي tungsten تحديدا the tungsten بالذات because tungsten has high melting point because tungsten has high melting point again filament of the light pulp or filament of the electric lamp is made of tungsten because it has high melting point another question that says it's a problem of lever and we know problem of lever is very interesting and very easy at the same time because it all it only needs one law and we can answer it easily if we know how to exclude the values again the question says if a boy sits on a seesaw it's what is 250 newton at a distance about 100 centimeters from the fulcrum and a girl sits on the other side her weight is 200 newton calculate the distance suitable to see this girl to make pump هنا هعمل بس كده يعني simple drawing the problem دي تخيل شكلها مع بعض let us draw simple drawing for this problem I can imagine that the boy the boy is, is sitting on the seesaw from 100 centimeter 100 centimeter for example it will be that 100 centimeter and he has what he has 250 newton ناخد بالنا ان هي مش كيلوغرام هي نيوتن طبعا لو الكيلوغرام هتبقى 25 كيلوغرام اونلي بس ما حدش يستغرب من رقم كبير قوي يعني اوكي okay. and a girl a girl on the other side a girl on the other side and her weight is 200 نيوتن is 200 نيوتن طبعا لو بكيلوغرام هتبقى 20 كيلوغرام اونلي I want the distance to make balance between them هنا عايز distance uh, to make balance or for the girl to set and the make balance between here and the point. So here I consider particular word how well F effort force and the girl is the resistance. So now the lever law states what F by F dot arm equal resistance by resistance dot arm or F by its arm equal resistance by its arm. So now let's conclude. Standing مع بعض أو نستخرج نعمل نقول كذا في العربي النتائج أو values. The effort force is 250 newton. The effort force arm is 100 centimeter, and the resistance is 200 newton. So I want now the resistance force arm. The resistance arm equal what? The resistance arm equal as we have practiced more and more. The Rabna after Mara ala hal masail lever 250 by 100 over 200. So I can divide 101, 102. So it will be 250, 250 divided 2 by calculator. It will be 100, 125 centimeter, 125 centimeter. Why centimeter? Because we know, we know that the resistance arm has the same unit of effort force arm. The effort force arm has the unit centimeter, the resistance arm. Damon, a resistance, the unit of the effort force, Newton and newton so again it will be 125 newton it will be 125 so again the lever's law is a very easy law that states that effort force by effort force arm 
equal resistance by resistance R. But I prefer, or all science teachers prefer that, to write the law in abbreviation letters. دايما مدرسين ساينس بتحب قوي نكتب اي لو اي قانون بشكل مختصر بحب اكتب F by F dot R equal resistance by resistance dot R. And this is a very important law or the only law that we have started this semester to answer the problems of levers. ده القانون الوحيد اللي درسناه السنه دي عشان نحل بيه اي مسائل ليفر. So again another another problem of lever the, the problem says a long uniform metallic bar is hanged from its midpoint a force of 40 newton exerts at 5 centimeter from this midpoint find the width which must be hanged at 25 centimeter to make the bar get balanced. برضه هتخيل شكل الليفر I have a long metallic uniform bar, long uniform metallic bar like that. From the midpoint, it's hanged, it's hanged from the midpoint. A force of 40 newton, here is 40 newton, exert at 5 centimeter, 5 centimeter. From this midpoint, find the width, and I use width in the middle of the other side, to make balance, find the width, which must be hanged at 25 centimeter, at 25 centimeter. So here, I will consider, I will consider the left side is force and the right side will be the resistance. So, the lever law states that, قانون رافع بيقولي أكتر مرة كتبناه effort force by effort force R equal resistance by resistance R. So, again, effort force is what? Is 40 Newton. Okay? By effort force R is 5 centimeter. Okay? Equal resistance is what? Resistance. I want this resistance. And here, موجودة عندي أو هي المطلوب عندي أن أجيبها. Resistance by resistance force arm is 25 centimeter. 25 centimeter. So resistance is what? Or resistance equal what? Equal 40 by 5 divide 25. So by calculator, I can abbreviate divide 5 equal 1 divide 5 equal 5. So 40 divide 5 equal 8. 8 what? 8 newton. Again. Why Newton? Because we know, we know that, we know that force has the same, has the same unit of resistance. The resistance has the same unit of force. So again, for 8 Newton, not, not centimeter, because it has the same unit of the effort force. It has the same unit of effort force. So again, another problem, another problem. The problem says the length of the force arm of a crowbar is 100 centimeter and the length of the resistance arm is 15 centimeter. When I open the lever, in the Araha carefully, you must read the uh, lever's problem carefully. Araha be anaya kwaiz awa ashan atalla minna the values or the qiyam that I'll be here. If the value of the resistance equals 400 newton, calculate the value of the effort force and mention the type of lever. Mention the type of lever. هنا السؤال مطلوب مني حاجتين مطلوب مني احل المساله اطلع ال value of the effort force وكمان اقول له نوع الليفر طبعا ده موضوع قلنا اكتر مره ضربنا كتير جدا طب first step اول خطوه زي ما اتعلمنا نحل مسائل الليفر you must write the law effort force by effort force arm equal equal what resistance by resistance arm so here the length of the force arm the length of the force arm of crowbar is 100 centimeter the force arm is here دايما او ممكن جدا في بعض المسائل ما يجيلناش ال values بالترتيب فممكن يطلب مني ال effort force resistance اي حاجه لكن مش لازم كلهم يكونوا in arrangement بالترتيب and the length of the resistance arm the resistance arm is 15 centimeter resistance arm is 15 centimeter if the value of the resistance equal 400 value of the resistance 400 newton calculate the effort force هنا مطلوب مني احسب ال effort force so here effort force isn't found and it is a demanded or it's demanded from you. So effort force equal what? Effort force equal. On after Mara Dam and Bakud El Side El Kamil Kolo or Kamukulaha Maguda. Four hundred by fifteen divide hundred. So it will be I can abbreviate two zero with the two zeros. Then four hundred divide hundred equal four. Four by fifteen equal secrecy. Secrecy what? Surely I said or I told you more and more effort force have the same unit of resistance. I'm going to problem. Can be only a resistance, 400 Newton. If I can manage effort force is measured in Newton. So it will be 60 Newton. Again, it will be 60 Newton. So 
I have another question in this problem. What is the type of liver? A no liver. طبعا عشان حد نوع الليفر بدور على ايه دايما بدور على حاجتين في المسألة number one if it's first arm and the resistance arm number two if it is there is an example لو في example في المسألة طب هنا if it's first arm 100 resistance arm 15 so if it's first arm is longer than the resistance arm if it's first arm is longer than the resistance arm and this condition is found in what? is found in first class lever and also second class lever طب هنا حاجة تخير هو first ولا second بس هو ألف أول مسألة هي كروبار يعني كروبار العتلة and we know كروبار is what كروبار is a first class lever so this lever is a first class lever not second class lever although it has effort force arm longer than the resistance arm so again عشان أحدد نوع lever مهم قوي إني أبص على حاجتين في البروبلم نمبر 1 نمبر 1 لو في إكزامبل في البروبلم هيوضح لي المسألة كويس جدا فور إكزامبل هير إت سيز ذا كروبار كروبار العتلة أند إف وي درو ذا كروبار وي ويل فايند ذات ذا فالكرام أو إز فاوند بيتوين ذا ريزيستنس أند إيفورت فورس سو إتس ذا فيرست كلاس ليفر ذا نمبر 1 يبقى عشان أحد نوع ليفر بدور على إكزامبل نمبر 2 بدور على إيفورت فورس أرم وريزيستنس أرم لو إيفورت فورس أرم لونجر ذان ذا ريزيستنس أرم It may be first or second class lever. Now, if it first arm is shorter than the resistance arm, it surely, it surely that third class lever. Li, shan is third class lever doesn't save effort at all because has if it first arm is shorter than the resistance arm. So now another problem. The problem says that in the second class lever, the effort force is 150 newton. The length of the first arm is 20 centimeter. And the resistance is 300 newton. First step, I will cut off and any problem. Back to the law. We will find the values that are present in the problem. The values that are present in the problem. And we will find what will we do after that. So, first step, I will cut off. Write the law. Effort force by effort force R. Connect them together. Effort force by effort force R equal resistance by resistance R. Okay. Effort force by effort force R. Equal the resistance by the resistance arm. So now, what's what's after that? The problem says, Ms. Akabet Oli, in the second class lever, the effort force is 150 newton. Effort force can 150 newton. So I can write 150 under effort force. The length of the force arm is 20 centimeter. Next to the force arm, 20 centimeter equal what? And the resistance is 300 newton. Bravo, Mukhrik, be be tabayna kwa is our problem. The resistance is 300 newton, and the resistance arm is demanded here. So here, the problem says calculate the resistance arm. So how can I solve this problem? I can write the resistance arm is what is 150 by 20 over 300. So I can omit two zeros with the two zeros. Tasar ma'bad our bil calculator taban. Divide three equal one. Divide three equal five. So 5 by 2 equal what? Equal 10. 10 what? Effort force arm has the same unit of the resistance arm. So this arm is here with centimeter and also the resistance arm will be 10 centimeter. يبقى مهم قوي عشان ما تلخبطش في اليونت دايما الارم has the same unit centimeter or meter and effort force and the resistance force has all has also the same unit which is Always or usually is newton. دائماً أو غالباً بيكون نيوتن. طبعاً ممكن تبقى بالكيلوغرام بس يعني it's rarely نادراً ما بيكون بالكيلوغرام. دائماً ال effort force or resistance force has the same unit which is newton, which is what, which is newton. So now we have answered many problem of lever and we have practiced more and more and also have practiced a complete question and in this question I advise you. Let's talk of the complete. Please read the question carefully till the end word. Here is the last word. قبل ما تجاوب أي حاجة. Another type of question which is choose the correct answer. In this question, I advise you again, read all the choices. إيه رأي كل الاختيارات? Because maybe ربما يكون there is more than one answer is correct. ممكن يكون في أكثر من إجابة صح. Maybe A and B, A and C, all the previous B and C and so on. So please read all the choices. إيه رأي كل الاختيارات? Number one says that. All the following conduct electricity except iron, copper, cloth, aluminium. كل الحاجات اللي جاية بتوصل الكهرباء. Conductor, 
except Mada, iron, copper, cloth, aluminium. Surely, cloth is a is an insulator or is a bad conductor of electricity. ولا يعني بحب التسمية دي قوي بس طبعا بنحب أكتر تسمية insulator يعني مواد عزلة للكهرباء. Cloth like cotton, wool, and polyester, all of them are insulator or bad conductor of electricity. But iron, copper, aluminium, and all metals, all of them are conductors of electricity. كلهم conductors مواد مواصلة للكهرباء. Another question that says the partial solar eclipse appears in the area of Ampra, negative shadow, Benambra, and Tambra. We know that the partial solar eclipse appears or occurs in the area of the word that begins with the letter B. On that, because the كلمة سر مهمة قوي إن the partial بيبدأ في منطقة بتبدأ بحرف B زي partial بالضبط. So it will be Benambra. So let us remind, نفتكر مع بعض. What about the annular solar eclipse? It occurs in the Antambra. النوع اللي بنسميه أيور أو كوسو شمس حلقي اللي بيبدأ بحرف الـ A بيحصل في منطقة بنسميها أنتامبرا اللي بتبدأ برضه بحرف الـ A. So again, the partial solar eclipse appears in the area of Benambra, but the total eclipse occurs in the area of Ambra, and also the annular النوع الحلقي بيحصل في الـ Antambra أو اللي بنسميه ساعات ممكن كمان نسميه نيجاتيف شادو، يعني أنتامبرا هي بنفس معنى نيجاتيف شادو اللي بيحصل فيها النوع بنسميه Annular solar eclipse, or kusuf shams halaki. Another question that says, the filament of the light bulb is made of tungsten, copper, lead, and iron. The filament of the light bulb is made of tungsten, copper, lead, and iron. Sure, that's a very frequent question. So al mutakarir gidan. It's made of tungsten. Why? Because tungsten has high melting point. قلت قبل كده الرقم الخاص بالتنجستين تقريبا هو بيوصل 3400 سيليسيوس عشان يحصل لتنجستين ملتنج لازم يوصل لحراره 3400 درجه سيليسيوس او مئويه طبعا دي درجه عاليه جدا جدا بالمقارنه باي ميتال تاني. So we have chosen اخترنا التنجستين especially in manufacturing of filament of light bulb because it has high melting point. Higher than copper, higher than iron, higher than lead itself. أعلى من أي معدن تاني في درجة الانصهار. يبقى أكتر معدن بيتحمل الحرارة أو بيتحمل أنه يحصل له glowing يعني يحصل له كده إشعاع حراري وبياخد حرارة عالية جدا بسبب الكهرباء اللي بتمر فيه هو التانجستين. عشان كده هو أحسن معدن ينفع أو يستخدم في filament of the light bulb. Again, the filament of the light bulb is made of tungsten because it has the highest melting point all over all the metals. Another question that says, when we connect more than one bulb in parallel, an electric source, the lightning of the bulbs, what? لما بوصل أكتر من لمبة parallel. هنا السؤال ده ممكن يلخبطنا شوية. The light bulb or the lightning of the bulb, the light bulb, the light bulb, decreases, but it increases, but it doesn't change. A, P, and C. I can hear the answer from the teacher. If it's a light bulb, the light bulb will decrease. It's obvious because it's parallel. The light bulb will increase. Of course, no. The light bulb will actually when it's the increase, the light bulb will decrease. But in the case of parallel, the light bulb doesn't change. It doesn't change. So that's why I always say that parallel will be independent connection. The increase, the increase, will be independent. Because there are branching routes, which are connected to the lamps. So the light bulb will not decrease, will not decrease. It's very strong, very strong. When we connect more than, when we connect more than one bulb, one bulb in parallel. A light source, the lightning of the bulbs doesn't change or decrease, increase A, P, and C. Surely it will doesn't change or it doesn't change. ما في غيارش لأن الإضاءة في ال parallel هي ثابتة وهي قوية جدا أصلا. Another question that says, first class lever differ from second class lever in what? Sure, so I'll say maybe the choice will be طويل جدا عندي أكتر من choice. Absence of active force, presence of fixed point, position of the fulcrum. Absence of act force had mafish force, presence of fixed point, while the position of the fulcrum, surely it will be the position of the fulcrum. طبعا اي نوع lever بيختلف عن اي نوع تاني بسبب مكان الفالكرم او حتى ممكن اقول له position of the effort force او position of the resistance. نفس الاجابه بالظبط هو كلهم بيختلفوا عن بعض in the position or the middle point. مين هي النقطه اللي في المنتصف؟ لو هي O يبقى first class lever قلنا اكتر مره الكلام ده. لو هي R يبقى second class lever. لو هي F يبقى third class lever. Another question that says, 
When the moon comes between the sun and the earth, what happened? When the moon becomes the nose in the middle between sun and earth, tornado, solar eclipse, lunar eclipse, tsunami. Surely we have a very interesting phenomena. The very shocking thing, being that we have solar eclipse. When the moon comes between the sun and the earth, we have solar eclipse happen. Solar eclipse, the very kusuf is shams because the moon hides all the sun or a part of it. From coming to the Earth, that makes solar eclipse type. We have more than one solar eclipse. How much total, partial, and also the annular? Another question that says: The filament of the light bulb is made of tungsten because it has high, has low density, has low melting point, has high melting point, reacts with oxygen. طبعا سؤال متكرر جدا انه اكتر مره النهارده وفي كل الحلقات اللي فاتت لان تنجسين عنده هاي ميلتنج بوينت هاي ميلتنج بوينت انذر كويشن ذات سيز تويزر از كونسيدرد از ا ثيرد كلاس ليفر بيكوز ذا فالكروم از بيتوين ذا ريزيستنس فورس اند ذا ايفورت فورس ذا ايفورت فورس از بيتوين ذا ريزيستنس اند ذا فالكروم اور سوري ذا ذا فالكروم اوكي The resistance force is between the effort force and the fulcrum, or the resistance force and the effort force are parallel. Taman twister هو النوع التالت. هنا عارفين كويس أوي the third class lever أو النوع التالت من the lever بيكون عندها O R F F in the middle. عارفين كلمة سرية O R F R. لو O in the middle it will be first class lever. R in the middle it will be second class lever. F in the middle. طب F هنا اختصار مين؟ اختصار effort force. So the answer will be that. Effort force between the resistance and the fulcrum. Effort force is between the resistance force and the fulcrum. Another question that says: To observe solar eclipse safely, you should wear. عشان ألاحظ أو أشوف كسوف الشمس بأمان ما يحصل ليش أي أضرار لا قدر الله أو for example the blindness لا قدر الله فقدان البصر أو lose of sight. We should wear لازم أرتدي أو ألبس special glasses. Heavy clothes, medical glasses, lenses. Surely we know we must wear special glasses. Why? Because special glasses protect our eyes from harmful radiation such as ultraviolet and infrared radiation. في أشعة ضارة جدا تكون موجودة في الشمس أو شمس تطلقها في الوقت دوت بنسميها infrared أو ultraviolet ودي أشعة خطر جدا جدا. ف please أن الموضوع ما فيهوش تجربة وخطر جدا. لو فرد إن سمعنا في أي يوم الأيام إن في solar eclipse we must wear. We must wear. مش بقول should. لا must. عارفين كويس أو إن must في الإنجليش أقوى كتير جدا من should. لازم ألبس special glasses to protect our eyes from harmful radiations such as ultraviolet and infrared radiation because they may cause cutting of retina. ممكن يسببوا كده قطع الحاجة اسمها الشبكية جوانينا that may cause blindness. وده ممكن يسبب لا قدر الله عمى. ف please الموضوع ما فيهوش هزار ولا تجربة خالص. لو في أي يوم سمعنا solar eclipse phenomena, we must wear what? We must wear special glasses. Another question that says, which of the following, which of the following is the second class lever? مين في الحاجات الجاية دي هتكون second class lever? Sweet holder, wheel paro, seesaw, hockey pad. Sweet holder, wheel paro, seesaw, hockey pad. Surely we have many examples of second class lever such as wheel paro, عربة الحديقة. Wheel paro, nut cracker, starter bundle, and also bottle opener, فتحة الزجاجات. All of them are Second class lever. Wheel paro is a second class lever, and also the stapler. Command the base. Second class lever. Another question. Plugging many machine to one socket may cause plugging. I mean, if I put the fish in a different hand, in the same socket, in the same fish, or in the same socket, may cause. That can be a cause. Electric overload, heating up wires, fire, A, P, and C. Please don't be fast. Don't be very, very fast. Please don't be very fast. Don't be very, 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 very fast. Don't All the previous answer or P, A, P, and C. The answer is correct. So I chose A, B, and C. Okay. 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 Ok
A, B, and C أو ساعات بيسموها all the previous answers كل الإجابات السابقة are correct So again Plugging many machines to one socket may cause electric overload heating up of wires fire A, B, and C all all the previous answers are correct Another question that says In the annular solar eclipse في كسوف الشمس الحلقي اللي بنسميه annular The moon size appears What the size of the sun حجمه بالنسبة للشمس قد ايه تقريبا Larger than Smaller than Equal to More tiny than So again The annular solar eclipse The moon size appears to be what? To the size of the sun Sure we can see the lighted ring of the sun بشوف بس حلقة مضيئة من الشمس يوم معنى كده ان حجم الامر اصغر من الشمس حجم الامر اصغر لانه قرب عليها جدا فبيسيب بس الاحرف المضيئة من الشمس اللي بنسميها Lighted ring او Uh, annular solar eclipse يبقى هنا هيكون حجم القمر smaller than the size of the sun smaller than the size of the sun another question that says the lunar eclipse occurs in the point of the lunar month كسوف الش... الاسف كسوف القمر بيحصل امتى في الشهر القمري we have middle منتصف الشهر end نهاية beginning first three days surely we know that lunar eclipse occurs when the moon is in the phase of full moon بيحصل هو بيحصل مرتين في السنه لكن بيحصل لما بيكون القمر في حاله ميدل اوف ذا مانث منتصف الشهر اللي بنسميه فول مون قمر كامل او بدر كامل اللي بنسميه قمر 14 عشان كده بنسميه 14 ليه لانه تقريبا بيكون بالظبط في نص الشهر يعني يوم 14 من الشهر عشان كده بنسميها فول مون او ميدل اوف لونر مانث سو اجين لونر اكليبس اوكيرز ان ذا ميدل اوف لونر مانث في منتصف الشهر القمري وان ذا مون فيز لما بيكون شكل القمر حالة بنسميها full moon again lunar eclipse occurs in the middle of the lunar month another question that says during the start of the total lunar eclipse the color of the moon tends to be what لون الامر بيتحول لإيه تقريبا gray, yellow, orange, red طبعا شكل الامر بيبان red والسؤال ده مشهور جدا في ال give reason uh, The question says so I'll be only كده نقطة نقطة مهمة جدا في give reason give reason the color of the moon tends to be red during the lunar eclipse ليه شكل الأمر بيبان أحمر في حالة lunar eclipse نكتب السؤال مع بعض give reason let us write this question give reason the color color of the moon color of the moon tends to be red during أثناء during The lunar eclipse. طب هشرح الأول بالرسمة كده هعرف أو هكتب is ليه بيحصل دوت. Okay. For example, imagine that there is Earth here and the Sun. Okay. And also the Moon is here. Earth, Sun, and the Moon. We know that in lunar eclipse, which body is in the middle? The Earth. And we know that Earth has what around it? Earth has atmosphere. أرد حواليها. حاجة بنسميها أتموسفير أو الغلاف الجوي which we have started in the last semester درسنا التالي وفات كويس أو and we know that this atmosphere contains drops of water vapor نقط أو بخار مية أو قطرات من بخار المية this water vapor makes what to sun rays or to the infrared rays في أشعة بنسميها الأشعة تحت الحمرة لما بتعدي من الأتموسفير وبتقابل ال water drops بيحصل لها عملية بنسميها light refraction درسناها كويس أوي في primary 5 يعني الضوء بينكسر Reaching the moon, the biosa del amar, and makes it red. Tam noli candles day. How old? Because, because some infrared rays, بعد أشعة تحت الحمرة, infrared rays are refracted. نخو بنا كويس أو من refracted, مش reflected. Refracted يعني انكسرت, مش تعكست. Refracted from from Earth's from Earth's surface or from Earth's atmosphere. From Earth's atmosphere, that that reach the moon, but they also the Amar reach the moon, reach the moon to make it appear with the red color. So I'll give you a little bit to appear with the red color. So I'm going to get them red color. So again, give reasons. The color of the moon tends to be red 
during lunar eclipse because infrared radiation refracted from Earth's atmosphere to reach the moon and they make it appear with the red color. So, by this question, I'm afraid we have uh, reached the end of this episode. I uh, promise you to meet again, but not next week, inshallah, next semester uh, when you are in prep stage. Thank you and goodbye. See you soon in prep stage.